So you want to learn how to stretch after your workout. Um, I got to. These are some of the stretches that I have done consistently over the last couple of months that have really helped me after my workout. So let's do this. First of all, you're going to need a yoga mat. Don't judge mine. She's been through a lot. Second, you're going to take off your shoes because you're going to need to wiggle yet house. Second, I'm playing music. I will do this in silence with you, but you can play music during this time. I will put some of my favorite ones down below. Uh, I have a stretching playlist that I will place down below if you want to go through that. And it's just music that makes me feel really good about myself and empowered. I always like to say that during this time, I want you to picture that you're the girl that you're that woman that singers write their songs about, especially reggaetoneros, because you're a bad bitch, okay? Let's do this. We're gonna start with your knees here, all right? Like this. And you're gonna start with putting your, your shoulders up here. And really feeling the stretch on your lats, which is like the part Basically, on the yoga mat here, like this. Next, in the same, so you're coming up from this position, and the last that I'm talking about is this, this side. Okay, so you're gonna focus on stretching that. So your hands are not to like the sides, your hands are not like the center, right? Now we come up. And we're going to thread the needle. That's what I call it. I saw that being called once and I, it stuck with me. I'm gonna take one arm and you're going to thread it under the other. Same position. And you're just like twisting your back a little bit to get that stretch. And hand like All right, hold it there. And then the next one. All right. I like these a lot. You're in this same position and you're just going to open like this. And your, your feet are like this, so in the center. And you're just widening your hips a little bit and you're going to do this. All right, this is gonna help with those hips. I try not to rock in this position. I just try to hold it like this. And same, just elbows down, hands down. And reach your forehead down. And hold it there, no rocking. Just keep it there. Do this with the yoga mat in the same position. And legs are closed together. Hands are directly under your shoulders. And you're going to here and then some elephant walks. Let's stand here and we're gonna do this. We're gonna bend one knee like this, alternating. My legs. And that feels really nice on um, the hamstrings. Um, the last ones that we're gonna do are going to be for the legs. So I like to start here, okay? And then one leg. This is one of my favorite stretches. A lot of people ask me why I do this. It feels so good on the inner thigh, on the thigh as a whole. And I'm just keeping this foot here. This is what works for me. You can try and then just stretch your point your toe a little bit and then back. I try to hold these for a little bit. Do the other leg. All right. You can keep your hands like this. And just stretch it again, point your toe. 
on your inner thigh and it's called a pigeon's pose. And do this like that. All right. One leg here and one leg stretch. And then just fold it down for a second. And this is the leg that you're stretching. This is the glute that feels the stretch, but the other one is also feeling it. that you can do to help with your mobility is gonna be something like this and just put your legs so like here and just stand here for a second keep it here in the meantime you can move your wrists okay you can move your wrists You just need a little movement everywhere to kind of like relax. Same thing. Wiggle your toes a little bit. It feels really nice. The classic one is to hold your leg out and here. Deep breath. at the time however long you have just adjust your routine to you you can absolutely finish your stretching routine with a little meditation moment and everything for five minutes or the entirety of the music of the song that you choose focus on the lyrics and relaxing your mind I hope you enjoyed this stretching routine. It's pretty simple. You can adjust it to however much time you have. If you have five minutes, if you have 10 minutes, but it is a very important part of your fitness journey to also connect with your mind and learn how to control certain things and your muscles need to stretch and your mind also needs to relax. So if you're somebody who's struggling with a stretching routine after your workout, this is perfect. And this is something that you can incorporate after every single lift. It looks exactly the same for me every single time. Um, and I will make a video with a pre-workout stretching routine because it looks very different. So if you enjoyed this video, give me a like and subscribe. Share with a friend that is struggling to stretch so you can hold yourselves accountable. And remember, you are a baddie. You're a baddie. You're the baddie that singers write their songs about. Just mentalize, really visualize yourself in that situation. Bad Bunny is writing songs about you, okay? <laughs> Thank you, and I love you. I'll see you next. Bye. <laughs>